keep moving. <sighs> what now? The Crystarium at a guess. Desperate fools. It'll take more than a handful of overgrown lizards to ground us. Let us free the Oracle from their clutches. Striking resemblance to the artist my master seeks. By all means, keep your counsel. You will all have ample time to confess your crimes back in Yulmo.
your city razed. I would sooner see it razed than conquered. Suffice it to say, we are ready to receive you. What now, Exarch? Will you face me yourself? I think not, General. I've quite exhausted my tricks. If you mean to give chase, I will not stand in your way. Well, you would do well to tread warily, for your quarry goes to a place where even you'll know dare not bear its steel. Ilmeg, the fairy kingdom. still had the energy to unleash his hounds. Even the most pointless of conflicts may alter a world's course. And now the plan has gone awry. But how? How did the so-called Crystal Exarch bring the hero of the Source to the First? if I didn't have enough on my hands already. <sighs> then again, with a soul such as that. Mayhap there is another way. One which does not require bloodshed. Not so long ago, here in the shadow of the northern ranges, lay the great kingdom of Verbert. A nation with a proud history that the Sin Eaters cut short, just like all the rest. Since that time, these lands have become a haven for fey folk. Dreamers frolicking amidst the ruins of a forgotten realm Should be safe enough here. It's good to see you again, my friends. I don't know about you, but it feels like years since last we met. Five of them in my case. Why, it only feels like one to me, but long enough to warrant a more convivial reunion either way. What brought you to Laxon Loft? The girl, Minfilia. She and I were travelling together, hunting Sin Eaters. But as we were nearing Lakeland, she abruptly ran off on her own. I found her too late to stop the Ulmorans from taking her prisoner. And as I was considering rescue options, I observed that the Crystarium was on the move. So I consulted the Exarch, who apprised me of the details of the operation and issued me certain instructions. Should the situation take a turn for the worse, I was to see you all safely to Ilmeg. And here we are. Orianger has called this place home for a while now. Yet we have never called upon him, I am ashamed to say. It was only at the Crystarium that we met. Hardly surprising. This is not the sort of place one visits on a whim. Happily, having trespassed on Orianger's hospitality for a spell, 
Menphilia and I have an idea of how things work around here. Sooner or later, the Ulmorans will come after us. But before they do, the Exarch bids us accomplish two things. First, rendezvous with Orianger. And second, eliminate the Light Warden of this land. So, Menphilia. What made you leave Thancred behind, if you don't mind me asking? You, the hero from another world. I was asleep when I felt it. A presence. Someone I was meant to meet. They were close and... And I knew I had to go to them. But with all the commotion in Lakeland, I was afraid that Thancred wouldn't let me. And would I have been wrong? Had I arrived a moment later, you would be back in your cell in Yulmore. And now we have Ranjit snapping at our heels. You really have outdone yourself this time. I'm sorry. Thank you for saving me. Oh, poor thing being scolded so. Who said that? Show yourselves. Come now, let's away that frown and have some fun with us. <laughs> yes, let us have some fun. Lots and lots of fun. Uh, which way was it to Uriange's? many times, but I'm not... I can't. Oh, why can't I remember? Damn it all. We're already caught in their spell. 